Let's go down, Jerome's. So as the Minnesota Fine Vikings are paring down the rooster down to the 53 initial uh, man roster, uh, one player is reworking his contract to be in the fold uh, for the Vikings in 2023. A veteran offensive lineman, Chris Reed, uh, the pride of Mankato State University Community College, redid his deal and this is according to Ben Gessling of the Star Tribune go uh, Vikings guard Chris Reed who's been on the NFI non-football injury list uh, during training camp reworked his contract late last week uh, for the second time this year Reed will now get a base of 1.165 million fully guaranteed uh, which is the veteran minimum minimum for a player of his stature uh, he'd been at 1.4 previously with 600,000 uh, guaranteed uh, Reed's 2023 cap number is now 1.515 million down from 1.75 million uh, yada 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 so basically you, you see this happen a lot where players that are you know on the fringe especially veterans uh sometimes uh general managers will squeeze for a bit of a pay cut and it, it's kind of a weird deal where obviously you know the fully guaranteed business is nice uh, but once he's on the team after week one his contract is fully guaranteed so basically it's a pay cut uh, in this spot the Vikings save a couple hundred grand uh, in cap space and you know Kwesi doing the damn thing uh, again and Chris Reed who I, I like a lot. He's 31 years young. He's 6'3", 3'14", uh, 2015 a UDFA out of Mankato State University Community College. Again, teammates with Adam Thielen. Uh, they go way back like chiropract. Now, uh, I, I like him as a utility backup, where ideally he won't see the field, but it, it's good to know that he's there just in case poo-poo does hit the fan. Uh, he played 124 snaps in 2022 uh, over two games, uh, Week 17 at Green Bay and Week 18 at Chicago. Now, Center snapping disasters uh, against Green Bay because Austin Schlutman broke his ankle and Chris Reed was tossed out there. Now, I think this comes down to coaching uh, a little bit where Reed was the backup center but clearly did not know how to snap the, uh, from shotgun. It was just ridiculous. But worked on things and w had a very solid game week 18 against Chicago, uh, and he is solid veteran interior offensive line depth. And the Vikings do need, new, do need it right now. So as a right meow – Here's what the Vikings offensive line room looks like. You know, Darius Ezra, Bradbury, Ed Ingram, uh, Brian O'Neill. They traded with Darian Lowe. They made a handful of cuts. Uh, so as of right now, that's still remaining. You know, Brandel, Schlutman, uh, Udo uh, are likely going to be part of the 53. Uh, I think Jack Schneider and both Alan Ali, who had been working with a second-team offensive line, have made good cases to uh, make the 53 or a minimum practice squad. Now, Chris Reed... It's interesting to see if they keep him on the non-football injury list. So the NFI is like the pup list, uh, except NFI means you, you were injured, but not in a NFL capacity. So not in a game. Not, we talk about the game. We talk about practice or practice or in the team facility. So Chris Reed's injury, whatever it is, is still undisclosed. You know, it took place away from the team. Uh, but he could be a candidate to start on the regular season non-football injury list, uh, which would save the Vikings a 53-man spot. Uh, he would have to miss a minimum of four games before returning, but I think uh, that is a very solid option right now as the Vikings are in a bit of a roster crunch uh, numbers-wise. And uh, what, whatever's ailing him, uh, get it completely right at 100%, and then we'll see him later on in the season. Uh, and, and obviously, you know, him redoing his deal uh, shows that the Vikings uh, do have him as part of their plans in 2023. Uh, but your thoughts are thoughts. Uh, Vikings veteran tier offensive lineman Chris Reed reworks his contract. The Vikings save a couple hundred grand in cap space. Uh, let us know your thoughts and our thoughts in the comment section below. Subscribe for Daily Vikings. Take Want to support the work? Put a little something in the Venmo, but to next time, Skull Production Value.